80s and their fandom are going through a rough week since the survival show Street Man Fighter consistent Vata executed a move similar to the iconic choreography for Say My Name during one of the challenging performance. So hey guys keep watching this video till the end and in a couple of minutes you will get to know what's gonna happen exactly by the end of this video. Since the controversy arose 80s fans have been accusing the dancer of plagiarism and even the judge Won Young himself is seen making his stance on the controversy known by using the biting gesture during the multiple instances to call out Vata for copying the move created by their own choreographers. One of the choreographer and this group has came forward and shared multiple stories on his Instagram account in support of 80s and making his stance on the plagiarism accusations and even making a personal statement regarding the issue. What made 80s fans even more upset is that this is far from the first time K-pop group 80s choreographers has been copied by other performers. Performers. Last time around this year, for example, their song Wave was sampled without permission by G Idol Soyeon for My Teenage Girl's final song. Luckily, in this instance, she and her agency did apologize for this plagiarism, but it was still upsetting for majority of the people. Not only this, additionally, Mnet has been accused multiple times of mistreating 80s during Kingdom Legendary War and 2021 Mama. Considering that Mnet host Street Man Fighter 80s fans are probably thinking that the group's agency may be trying to cover up the issue and move on without a proper response. Earlier in this season of Street Man Fighter, another contestant, Park Hyun Se of YGX and Loyal Charms, was allowed to make an official apology after he made an offensive now deleted post on Instagram, probably mocking rookie girl group New Jeans. While the issue was different than plagiarism, some of the fans are assuming this is another example that Amnet may be turning a blind eye towards 80s in this situation. This say my name plagiarism accusations and reactions have happened over the course of the past three or four days and during that time Wata and Amnet have mostly been silent about the controversy. Amnet posted a short statement and said in the midst of arranging a position while respecting the situation of the artist Wata as much as possible. Further upsetting fans due to 80s and their choreographers being the ones plagiarized in this situation. In order to continue to demand an apology from Amnet and Wata, a tiny have been flooding on social media with hashtags and phrases such as hashtag respect 80s, hashtag say my name 80s to keep the controversy alive and show that they won't just let it go without a fight. We really hope that 80s and their choreographers end up getting the response, the proper credits and the treatment that they deserve in this situation and for the incredible work that they do for their fans. So let us know what you think in this comment section down below and I will get back to you with a response. So guys that's all for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Do give a thumbs up to this video. Also subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell because this really makes me motivate to make new videos for you. So if you want to know what happened with Lee Jong Suk during his fan meet then do watch this video right now.